Okay, so we are at our targets. Um, I'm going to try and do this in English as best I can. Uh, that's our GPS coordinates at our targets. So I'm just going to already hit the mark start, so I just need to go to the position and shooting position, hit mark end. Our target is a 500 by 500 plate, a 300 by 300 plate, and some Sarah bottles, which is going to be quite difficult to hit at 500 meters, but let's see if we're lucky enough to hit them, but those two plates we should hit easily. Okay, so I'm going to go to my shooting position, and we can, yeah. Okay, so we're at our um, shooting position, this is going to hit mark end. You can see it's 472 meters, it's our distance. Targets at right at the bottom of that road, I'll zoom in just now. So a quick look, uh, just for the record, I, I'm just a novice shooter, hence the name of the channel, novice shooter. Just doing this for the fun, just enjoy myself. That's the rifle I'm using, it's my Hawa 308. Um, yeah, and we've got a Athlon Argos scope on here, 6 to 24 by 50. That's the scope I'm using. Yeah, and I'm using a 178 grain uh, bullet. It's a 100 in match BTHP match bullet, 178 grain. So, yeah, I'm just going to zoom in and then we can shoot some. Okay, so that's our target 472 meters. I'm gonna start off with the big targets and then just work my way down to the smaller one. Yeah, that was a hit. A little uh, to the left, the bottom, so big white plate, so yeah, I'm just gonna go up one flick. There's no wind really, just a little bit of a mirage going. Oh, my dawn. Yeah, I'm afraid my, just, my stand just collapsed. <laughs> okay, so I've managed to put the stand back together it's for some reason. It's a bit flimsy, these plates are very heavy. Now, but there's the first shot, the second one. A little bit of a wind starting to blow here. I didn't feel it blowing up there from the shooting position, but yeah, it's pushing the bullets a, bit, a little bit to the left. And for some reason, this orange bottle popped, I think it must be a piece of actually shrapnel from the bullet falling down, maybe the heat from the bullet melted it, yeah, and it just, you can see it's just a little groove, that's why this one popped actually from that bullet as the shrapnel fell down, it fell on the bottle I guess, yeah, so we'll go back and yeah, let's have a look at that one, need okay, um, I'm back, so let's hope that stupid stand doesn't fall with the next shot again. Hopefully we can hit the red plate and hopefully a soda bottle. Yep, that's the hit on the red plate, pretty much in the center, and the stand is still standing. So I'm going to try and hit a, a soda bottle along that left.
Yep. <laughs> That's it. That's how the bowl just popped. I'm going to... Let's see if I can do the one that's the orange one. I just hit the yellow one, so let's see if I can hit the orange one. So it's got a little bit in. Oh. Oh. Ah, pull that shot. See another one. Oh. I think I'm gonna do one more shot and then I'm done. I'm gonna go for the for the red plate again. Yep. Uh, maybe, okay, let's do one more, one more on the big white plate. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know what happened there, but for some reason I missed. Let's do one more. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so yeah, let's go back and see. For some reason I missed the big plate second last shot, don't know why. But our yeah, last shot was on target again. So let's go. Okay, so we're back at our targets. That's the last shot I fired. The one before that for some reason I missed. I don't know how that happened. And also did two two shots at a red plate, quite close to the middle there. Those two shots. Yeah, and I fired one shot at this yellow orange bottle. There's the hole as it bent in and out there. And I fired two shots at the orange one, but yeah, I missed those two. So yeah, just, just having a little bit of fun at least the stand kept up. So yeah, that's it for